brand new cookbook. It is called Lovin' Your Air Fryer. And if you love your air fryer, but you're looking for some inspiration, how about over 110 recipes for call and all meat lovers? lovers. How about blue cheese crusted beef tenderloin steaks? <laughs> Yes, please. That's some snow day food. How about some coconut crusted fish fillets? Maybe some dill pickle potato chip cod. All kinds of great finds like Oreo marshmallow pie from Eric Thies, who is loving his air fryer and wants to make sure that we're loving ours too. This is a cookbook that is not available anywhere else until March. You're getting a sneak peek at it and you're getting a full look at it today. And this is the way, remember that we're cooking with less oil, but now we're doing it with even more flavor thanks to our buddy Eric. And take a look at the back, a little smattering of the recipes. You can make every single one of these in your air fryer. More than a hundred, look at that. You can make a flourless chocolate cake with a raspberry ganache in your air fryer now, thanks to Eric. Now, Eric is a trained chef. He's the guy that we've loved in the power commercials, um, and we've loved him here at QVC for many years. But when it comes to making those recipes better than ever in your air fryer, Eric has done it for us. It's $4 on easy pay to get it home. I don't know if he heard me over there. Hey, Eric, it's $4 on easy pay to get your cookbook home today. Can you believe it? It's here. Four bucks. That's Four great. Bucks. That's you know awesome. What? That's fantastic. And hey, thank you so much. I'm so excited to launch my cookbook right here on QVC, my second home, right? Aww. So uh, uh, it's not going to launch at retail until March 15th. So if you want it now, you can get it now right here on QVC. Like you said, we have 110 recipes. Now, on the back, what I like to say is I'm going to give you that healthy crunch because we want to have a good tasty crunch. We want food that has lots of flavors in it. But if you can get that healthy crunch, oh man, then that's going to take you to the next level. Yeah. So get the healthy crunch. You want to start talking about some recipes that might be in the book? I sure do. I oh, just wanted, my, I just, my family. I wanted to show your tribe real quick. I just think they're lovely <laughs> people. Um, but you know what? Yeah, let's take a look at some of the food because we want to get cooking. It's a snow day and snow days make us hungry. What better day to cook than on a snow day, right? Right. So listen, game's coming up, right? We have the football game popping up. How about some nacho cheese balls? To okay. Start? Nacho cheese balls are really easy to make. They're literally air fried with nacho cheese dust on the outside. You, you just take stop. Doritos and crush them up. Fantastic. They're finger food. You air fry them right in your power cell or any air fryer will this book work with. Now, Let's just talk about dessert, right? Because I wanted to get right into it. Already 200 Here we have s'mores cones. So you Ooh. can make these ice cream cones, fill them with marshmallows and chocolate, graham crackers. Then you can top it with a cherry if you like. You could even add a little whipped cream. And you have the best s'mores cone you've ever tasted. And you can air fry it right in a little teacup right in your air fryer. So that's super fun and everybody gets their own, so you get to pick it up. That's adorable. One of the other things that I've been doing on QVC and infomercials forever is tater tots. I've bacon wrapped them. Oh, I've yes, you done have. everything with tater tots you can ever imagine someone doing to a tater tot. Well, here what we did is we did a tater tot bait. So you literally take the tater tots, you add tons of cheese and scallions and sour cream, and you get a uh, bacon, and you can put that in a Temptations or anything that's oven proof. They will fit in most of these air fryers that we have today, especially the one that we have on right now. And then I don't know about you, Mary, but I love salt and vinegar. Me too. So what I did is I do. I love it on everything. I love vinegar. I love that flavor profile. What I did here is I made a cider. I call them cider house wings. So they have a really cool flavor profile, lots of flavors on the wings themselves. And then what we do is we hit them with like a butter and apple cider vinegar sauce that goes over the top. And it's just like eating salt and vinegar, vinegar potato chips, but with chicken wings. Oh I mean, how gosh. much better can that be? Eric, this cookbook now, this... is flying. Um, oh, you showed us you, Cider God. House Wings. 
300 have now been ordered. Every time a minute goes by, it seems like another 100 oh. go out the door. Orange chicken wontons, hot Reuben dip. Um, a little, a little fun fact <laughs> about me. This house that is Mary DeAngelis was built on Rubens. Um, so, yeah, <laughs> I love house. Ruben dip. That's a good house. Um, but you know what? Desserts to small bites. I know we have a picture that we can pop up that shows all of the chapter headers. I'm not sure if we have that available today because I saw a look at it yesterday. But I love the different chapter headers. I mean, you've got desserts for us. You've got appetizers for us. You've got all kinds of great solutions. And when it comes to our air fryer, you know, We've dumped some fries into it. We've put some chicken wings in there. But you know what? Calling all meat lovers, we can make all. Oh, here's some from QVC.com. Eric's favorite rubs. You had me at chicken. I mean, these are all ideas that we need. There are those cute s'mores cones that you were showing us a moment ago. How sweet is this? Fishing for a compliment. That's adorable. And Eric, I've eaten your food. I know how good it is. And so the fact that these recipes have been tested by you, I know that they have a foodie stamp of approval for sure. <laughs> um, but can we take a look, so a look at some more food? Because more yeah. than 110 recipes, right? Yeah, more than yeah. 110. And every recipe has a tip or a trick. And I'd like to give everybody variations on a theme, right? So let's go up front here. Oh, we can stay there, guys. That's fine. All right. So right here, these are for you. Now, what I did is I made, uh, these are shrimp buffalo air fried, right? Mm. But now, what I did is I made them keto. So I give you variations in the book on how not to make them keto, but once you have these, you will maybe think about going keto on all of your crunch because we use pork rinds. And those pork rinds as breadcrumbs are better than breadcrumbs in most cases. So if you like pork rinds, if you like a healthy crunch, these are fantastic and they're keto. 400 um, if gone we come now. Back, if we come back here, now, you know, these air fryers have gotten larger. So now what we can do is we can do whole roasts. So this is a pork loin. And then what I did is I did a blackberry sauce. Now, the blackberry sauce is really cool because what I like to tell people, salty, sweet, and sour wins everybody's heartstrings. So this has the sweetness of the blackberries, it has some orange juice in it, it has some apple cider vinegar, so you get salty, sweet, and sour all in your sauce, lots of rubs and flavors on the pork itself. And then we, we have to talk about, we, we say, toss it and roll it, right? So we can do pizzas. <laughs> Did you go? say individual coconut streusel key lime pies? Yes, ma'am. What? <laughs> That's my favorite dessert in the whole world. And now I can make it in my air fryer. Are you kidding me? Yeah, hey, air, an air fryer is like the fanciest oven you could have, right? I mean, uh, you know, chefs spend so thousands and hungry. thousands of dollars. Now you can have it on your countertop and you can make all this stuff right on your counter. Baklava bites? Oh man, they're so good. Eric, I love honey. I love anything I'm that has honey in it. <laughs> I am coming over there. You know what? You come here right now and eat with me. Oh man, I'm so excited. Um, you know what? Keto battered me. fish and chips, dill pickle potato chip cod, salmon bordelaise. I mean, listen, it doesn't have to be all frozen French fries. We can get straight up Francie in our in our air fryers now. <laughs> yeah, but look at the ingredient list, right? And the directions. Very simple, yeah, very straightforward, lots of flavor, but with a healthy crunch. And I'm telling you, whether you're making a fig and goat cheese pizza or you're making sticky Korean drumsticks. Now, um, which one is that? that Tropical is bacon tro wrapped scallops. Yeah, you know, anything wrapped in bacon in an air fryer is magic. Bacon. Absolute magic. Bacon. I'm keeping this one. They're going to have to chase me down in the parking lot. They can't catch me. It's snowing outside. Um, you know what? We have over, oh, you're adorable. over 600 have now been ordered and in the kitchen with Mary. And that number is going to continue to go up throughout the show because, Eric, you're going to come back and talk to us all about the Power Air Fryer. And we're going to bring your cookbook along with us. What do you say?